today, we're gonna be going up against our strongest enemy yet, me. A modder by the name of Matsy has added me into the game, not as a tower, but as a balloon. Not just any balloon, but pretty much every variation of balloon there is. And on top of that, there is my own game mode, 2D Round. So we're gonna be playing 2D Round and seeing if I can beat myself. By the way, guys, if you do any shopping in Balloons Tower Defense, make sure to use my creator code. You can actually go up here to creator support, click on it, and put in code TUTI, T-E-W-T-I-Y. And anytime you buy anything in Balloons Tower Defense, it'll help support the channel, modders, myself, and everyone involved here. All right, we're going up against the Tootie round now, all right? We gotta be on our toes. I'm just gonna put down a good old boomerang monkey, and I guess I'll just throw down like my free dart monkey, I guess like up here for now. And so apparently I don't show up up until round 21 and then from there onward I start showing up a whole lot more so that gives us a little bit of time to kind of work up and be able to get a little bit of a defense going I'm not easy I'm not someone you want to mess with okay I hope they made me like cool and strong right even though I probably don't want that because then I'm gonna have to be battling myself on one hand I want I wish that I was weak but on the other hand I, I hope that I put up a good fight you know so we're gonna see what it's like if if I'm a balloon in this game. Uh, I probably want to go and get red hot ranks. Oh my gosh! Okay, I need to. Whoa! There's the 2D balloon. What the heck? Holy cow! That's so strong. All right, get a super monkey down. Whoa! The 2D balloon's like way stronger than I thought it was gonna be. It just like flew by. Did you see that? It was <laughs> it like actually just flew by. Okay, I'm gonna get a boat. I think here. I think it's gonna be pretty nice. And we can get grape shot and then double shot. I thought 2D balloon show up around 21. They do not. Okay, 2D balloon shows up at round 18. But look at all, it's actually pretty strong. Holy cow. Holy cow, am I gonna lose to 2D balloon? I don't wanna lose to the 2D balloon. Oh my gosh, it's actually so tanky. Am I gonna be okay here? I need a sniper. That's what I need. I feel like I need to get a sniper to deal with these pesky 2D balloons. That was way stronger than I thought it was gonna be. All right, there we go. That should help us deal with the 2D balloon. How do we not have any camo detection? What is happening? Okay, do I need to just get like... I'm just gonna let that guy go by for now. Do I have everything I need? Give me hot shot. I need to start getting some money down, but like I'm already kind of struggling, which is which is kind of insane. What the heck? What is... What, that's the most 2D balloons I've ever seen in my life. What the heck? I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna... I... What? That was insane. What the heck? That was like a ceramic rush at round 26? Okay, okay, all right, all right. Sell this, all right. Enough monkeying around. Give me a ring of fire, okay, and more tax. All right, that should be able to, that should be. Wait, what? Are they purple? Wait, no chance they're also purple. So is he immune to magic? Wait, how do I also not have Sada down? What am I doing with my life? Okay. All right. This is getting out of hand. So first things first, Sada has got to be placed down. I can't believe I never put Sada down. And then secondly, what? Okay. So I... Let's get a bomb shooter down. I'm... And then, all right, boom. I can't get recursive clusters, but maybe this will help. Okay, that was able to deal with it. I can't believe that they're purple. I, I'm, I guess I'm happy that I'm resistant to magic, but come on, man! You can't tell that they're purple. Like by any, like it doesn't seem like I'm a purple balloon, right? Like if if you had to guess, like what type of balloon would I be? I would not guess purple for sure. Like that was definitely not be on the top of my guessing game. Do I want a destroyer or a cannon ship? I definitely want a cannon ship. I feel like that's gonna be our best option. Let's get bomb blitz. All right, it's time to put down a village right here. Is Sada in range? Sada is in range. Very cool. Jungle drums, radar scanner. All right, we are cooking. Druid is probably really good here. What is that? What the heck? Pop it! Oh my gosh, it's a 2D Moab. Okay, can I get monkey pirates? Can I absorb it? Oh my gosh, it's so tanky. No, 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 no. Oh no, now there's three Moabs! What? What? There was three Moa. Okay, okay. I'm an enough monkeying around. Okay, can I just absorb it? Okay, 
Luckily, I can just absorb it with monkey pirates, but that's insane. Around 40, you have to deal with like a BFB that has three Moabs in it, basically. I am not prepared for the shenanigans that are taking place right now. I need to start like getting getting my life together in order to deal with all of this craziness. I guess we can do a bomb shooter. We can do more of like a primary. Yeah, let's do primary. Let's do a primary mentoring. I could I can go straight primary expertise, but I don't think that's what I want to do. Let's instead just get two central markets. Uh, make sure we absorb that because I do not want that thing coming through. That thing is a menace to society. I've been kind of enjoying the turbo charge recently. Not, not gonna lie. I've been, I've been thoroughly enjoying the turbo charge, perma charge, boomerang guy. I feel like he's been doing quite a bit for us. All right, we're doing pretty good. Let's just get another central market. Two more central markets, and I think that should be good for us until we get up to like round. I need 100 because I think it goes to round 100. Which, if it goes to round 100, we might need something more. I might need to save up for, like, Monkey Wall Street or something. We should get a Sticky Bomb Ninja. A Sticky Bomb Ninja, I think, would be really good. Especially up here in the front. Okay, let's absorb that. And then let's just... Actually, we can go ahead and get... Wait, is this going to be able to pop all of them? Okay, we can actually pop them now, which is pretty nice. But let's get Sticky Bomb... Ninja Discipline, Sharp Shurikens, obviously we're going to want both of those, which is really nice. May Moab could be kind of nice, but I don't think we have enough popping power in the front, so May Moab is just going to be kind of annoying to have at the moment. So I'm not going to worry too much about having that. What? Oh my gosh, we got a war we got a rush of 2D balloons coming our way. That's okay. Okay, what do we have primary that we don't have that we do want? I want a Moab Eliminator, and I need to make sure that it's in range. Because I real I could just get I'm just gonna go straight Moab Eliminator. I don't know what's the better cross path for this. I'm just gonna go heavy bombs. I just feel like that's like the better option. Make sure it's always targeting strong. And we have that ability. So he's just gonna be able to like constantly blast these balloons. I think we're in a good spot now where I can save up and try to get Monkey Wall Street. I think we're like gonna be okay here. I'm so far we haven't gone up against, but then again. We are about to go up against round 60, so we're going to have to go up against the 2D BFB, which I don't know how I feel about having to go up against, okay, there, against the 2D BFB. That does seem a little outrageous. Okay, luckily this thing is kind of like crushing it for us. Ooh, are we going to be okay going up? Oh, I really want this Monkey Wall Street. I'm going to just get it. I'm just going to get it. I might, I am, I might deeply regret it. But I think the next option is primary expertise because we get more popping power, we get more range, and that's for all of our primary towers. It's the 2D BFB! Pop it! Oh my gosh, a Moab Eliminator didn't even pop it? Holy cow! That required two Moab Eliminator shots. It takes like four to pop a BAD. That thing was tanky. Not to mention all the balloons that were probably inside of it. Okay, primary expertise. I think we're actually, like, rolling now. What else do we want that I think that's gonna be? Like, Pirate Lord, you can't go wrong with Pirate Lord. Just more abilities to, like, absorb Moabs. I think that's, like... That was round 63, by the way. Like, trying to give you a perspective of how, like, more difficult this 2D balloon is. Look at how easily, like, round 63 is going. And then once... Then see what happens with, like, the 2D BFB. I'm not gonna use any abilities on it. Can we even pop it? Look at how strong it is. We're on round 65, okay? And it almost got through. It almost got through. And we've got a Pirate Lord, a Moab Eliminator, a Primary Expertise with a Ring of Fire, Recursive Cluster, Turbo Charge. That is insane. I think May Moab might not be a bad idea. Actually, you know what I want? These, these balloons are... Wait. Oh, those are like the 2D Moabs, and these are like the 2D BFBs. So there's like different kinds that you have to go up against, which is really funny. So I can't put these anywhere here. That seems like a pretty big waste of, like, space. But I think I get long range anyway, so let's get long range. That's really nice. Red Hot Kylie, Moab Press, and then Moab Domination, which is going to be really nice. And we can get... I think faster throwing is just the better option, right? Also have these guys on strong. Like, oh yeah, look at this. Now we're able to actually push these 2D balloons back. So the 2D balloons are going to be pretty good to just like kind of take care of. I That's true. I want to just use the Monkey Buccaneer ability and see how many pops we get by absorbing like a 2D Moab, right? Or a 2D BFB. All right, this has 160,000. 
And then it didn't even absorb all of them. I think it could only absorb one. All right, and make sure we use our abilities as well. That is pretty crazy. I'm actually going to put down a super brittle because it allows them to take even extra damage. Enhanced freeze, deep freeze, and then what are some other options here? Basically, I just need all like Moab popping towers. The more Moab popping towers I have, I feel like the better off we're just going to be in general. We can get longer range. We can just have ballistic missile dropping on them. Well, let's get glue gunner. We can go ahead and just get super glue, which is really nice to have. Is there any other things that we want to get? And then, honestly, I think we just save up and get an MAD, right? Like, I think, and then we could just put the MAD right here. And then we can't afford it just yet, but we should be able to soon. And now we've got this guy launching. Now, now balloons, okay. Round 80 is right around the corner, so now we have to go up against the 2D Zoe MG. Is the 2D Zoe MG going to be more difficult than, like, all the other things so far? I hope so. But, also, we have just an literally an army. All right, what's this? Oh, my gosh. It's it's so slow coming out. But that's the 2D Zoe MG. Oh, there we go. Look at how much it's tanking. Holy cow. It's still going. Okay, get the MAD on it. And this thing was... It has four ZOMGs in it. And that's not even the end of it, my friends. Okay, we still have more to go against the 2D balloon. This thing's already got 150,000 pops. Pirate Lord's doing good. These all are just kind of doing crazy. We've got, like, every T5 that just excels at popping mobs. Like, every single one of them. Maybe not Century Champion. So, why not? Let's grab it. All right, there we go. And then larger service area, deconstruction, which I don't think there is. I'm pretty sure we just have to go up against the final. T like, look at, okay, the DDTs only get to like here before they get popped, which is insanity. Let's go to round 99. Keep using this, 200,000 pops, 200,000 pops, almost a million, 500,000, 200,000 uh, bomb blitz. Oh, what, round 100? What are those? Wait, are those the 2D BADs? Oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Holy cow, they're, wait, 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 wait. They're like not, they're like high key not popping. All right, I have $300,000. Um, okay, sell, sell. Ninja Paragon, maybe? Or Boomerang Paragon. Let's try to, oh, we're actually pretty close to Boomerang Paragon. We only need to get top path. Okay, Glaive Dominus. Okay, let's get the Boomerang Paragon because we actually have to get it. These are all 2D BADs. All right, we got the Boomerang Paragon. Okay. He's got like a million. He's almost got a million pops. Wait, there's no way. It's got over 1 million pops and we still... 1.6 million pops and we haven't popped it? No way. Wait, what? I was not expecting this. Uh, all right. They're all purple balloons, too. Uh, are we? I don't know if we're going to be able to pop them. These are the 2D BADs. It's got over 4 million pops. What the heck? They're not even taking damage. What? Holy cow, we had a paragon. Wait, wait, no way. R review map. Look at this thing. It had 6 million pops. None of them. Those were like 20 boss balloons. So technically 2D won, but 2D also lost. I don't even know. Guys, if you enjoyed this, hit the like button. I'll see you guys later.